I am going to fix this china bulb or break it trying. This bulb I had a video of previously. There's, <laughs> would you believe it? There's a link in the prescription. Heat gunned it. But, uh, you know, actually it's probably not a good idea to do that. It, uh, it got a little too much heat gun on it. But that's okay because there's a glass covering on it. I have this at the top of my stairs in the basement. And that's what it's doing now. For a while it would work and it was fine. And then it would do the flicker flash strobe kind of thing. And now when you shut it. It dims out. Let's shut the light. Yeah, that's not worth a shit. It's like a night light. It works for that. And shut it off and it just doesn't. So we are going to try the old heat gun trick again. Because why the fuck not? The thing's already melted. It's not worth anything. It doesn't do a damn for anybody. Move the drink out of the way. So let's just heat gun the shit out of it, right? If I melt it more, great. I can't seem to pop the uh, the cover off of it. So when it's time for that we get to that point, then I'll have to drum it off. Um, fuck it, let's do it with it on, right? We got heat. And because towel, I can turn this around and heat it unevenly. Oh, flickering. Oh! We had something. Ultimately, this cover is going to have to be removed, I'm sure, so I don't care if I coat it completely melted. We were getting good for a bit. I'll heat the base a little. Oop, didn't like that. Ooh. Oh, did I kill it? No. <laughs> hey, a little bit. I can't just stick a screwdriver in it and break it off. Yeah, I don't think the heat gun is going to do too much more than that. It's like an ice cream cone that's melting. It's still on. Can it move any at all? Let me get a flat blade. Just nothing. It is like firmly attached and also kind of too hot to hold. 
It still is working, barely. I think it's yellowed. It's quite hot. Can a guy just grab it with the thing and... Nope, that's too hot. Yeah, they just don't want you going in there. Okay. Um, maybe that'll work. <laughs> it is broiling hot. Yow! Get in there. Still works. You know, to break out the damn Dremel... And then I'm only going to heat gun it inside anyways. All right. Oh, I think it may have just crapped out. No, it's still got just the tiniest sign of life. Hmm. When are you going to heat gun that, Jay? When is now? Yeah, I said the wrong thing. Hung out with XJO81X today. What do you expect? Calling everything the wrong thing. Calling the right thing the wrong thing. The wrong thing the right thing. I gotta find a cutoff wheel and all kinds of great stuff here. Well, here goes nothing. This is the same cutoff wheel that bent and went completely haywire in another video on a microscope stand. There's a link to that in the prescription, as well as to this tool. Let's see where we're going to cut. I'm thinking just pop this off and then we'll see from there. Well, we're going to need a little more speed than that. He's taking a leak. We just hot glue that back on after. All right, good. So there it is. Ooh, plastic dust. There are two little screws. See what it does. Not gonna be touching it while it's turned on. Sorry. You see that? Sorta. Of. Oh, we. Wow. Well, that's not gonna do any good. 
Um, yeah, I was going to say, do we hit it with the heat gun first? Or, you know, like what do we do first? I know, let's take the screws out and look to see if there's like a bulging cap that there won't be or something like that. Little China screwdriver set. I can't remember the name of it. I never can remember the name of it. So we'll call it, uh, we'll call it the Hu Flung Poo. And obviously the answer is some dumb fuck. Will the little purpley screwdriver fit? It will. Very awfully tight. Why? Bigger? Yeah, that works better. Hello, there we go. Apparently this is one of those days where I get to get every tool I own out, so that's nice. All right, so that should come out. Like I said, that should come out. Fucking for real? It's got a fucking connector? Are the pins just shit on it? Is that why it's been causing all these problems? Well, we're going to need a lot more magnification for that. No, they're not bad. Definitely not bad. I don't think I can see in there. No, it just it just fits on and just does its thing. And it can only go one way. It has no other you know, it just is what it is. I have never seen one like this. Uh, usually I've seen them, you know, have like a wire So somehow I have to get this lined up and push back. See, that was difficult. Okay, so we did absolutely nothing. Oh, Hu Flung Pu has a little magnet for the screws. See? So that's nice. Still nothing. Okay. Let's heat gun it. Just, just you know, just for a second. Just see if the increase in temperature will do anything. doesn't like it. Yeah, it kind of doesn't like it. All of the LEDs No, there actually are some these are clusters of, there's no way, unfortunately, that the camera can make this out, I don't think. It's never going to focus on it. Do 
the LEDs seem to have 369 and only this one has all nine lit. That's got eight, that's got eight, 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 and eight. Of course, there's always the trick of shorting across them with a pair of tweezers. Um, I guess I could blow myself up, right? We can give it a shot. I got some here somewhere. No idea if this will work. I've seen it done. These probably aren't insulated, and I'm going to get a shock. I think I want to short across the one with the nine. Let's see what happens quick. Well, the rest got brighter. I'm going to hold on it. It's not actually short. Yeah, there. So the whole bulb is just failing. It's interesting that when I do that, it gets brighter. Oh. Was it a fucking touch lamp? Certainly brighter. Oh, dimming out, crapping out. I'm just fucking around in case you haven't, you know, realized. It would seem to me the problem is underneath. I could heat gun that. Maybe that was the whole problem from the get-go. Well, maybe I should leave it in there, actually. Well, it's supposed to be off, but... I'll just kill this here. That way I know for sure. Come on, you came out before. There is certainly a capacitor in there. So let's heat gun that. And then we'll put the little LED board back and try it again. Got need power. Whatever other components in there. Okay, I think that ought to be enough to see if it's happy or not. I should just sort of go back. Supposed to. 
right where the screw holes are. I think I got it. Nothing, of course. All right, well, I, I guess I didn't end up breaking it. I think the cats are going ape shit. Yeah, definitely something else wonky going on. Oh! Hello! There's our problem. Now, um... poke at it heat it with the heat gun till I can get it off with the tweezers that's the problem the rest of the bulb won't last doing that but yeah so it's right where it's marked D2 Cool. Well, I don't think I could get a soldering iron in there, and I don't think I would need to. I think just enough heat to break it off, and then as far as jumping it, <laughs> I'm never going to be able to solder it. Mm, yep. Okay. So let me dick around for a while. Well, some more dicking around with the heat gun. And that's what we're left with. And that actually has set me up, I think, pretty good. Because I've pretty much gotten rid of the rest of the RED. Well, okay. That's live because... I'm holding it and this is plugged in backwards this is not polarized so that's what it is okay but if I just short right on that there you go so basically I could just solder blob over that and uh, it'll work for how long not long but hey at least we're gonna fix it doesn't have to last long it just has to last long enough for the video, you know, and then I'll end up having to get a new bulb anyway. Okay, board level soldering is not my thing. So, I have no idea what's going to happen here. You just get enough solder to reach. There we go. And we're just going to heat and apply some solder which of course is not sticking to it at all there we go just blob over the whole fucking thing I don't care what it looks like there he goes doesn't have to look good bulbs a piece of shit anyway Okay, the question is, did we fix it? Plug it back in. Yes! Sort, sort of. What the fuck with this thing? 
it either makes connection or it doesn't. And now it's too bright for me to see. Uh, where are the tweezers here? Just want to go in an area on the board where I can wiggle it in case. Where? Yeah. All right. Well, we fixed and broke something at the same time. If I just mush on that, no. It literally seems like it's a problem with the where the board connects to this thing. And the problem now is it's too uh, bright for me to fuck with. <laughs> so I fixed it and didn't fix it at the same time. It's kind of what we're down to. The solder worked, so we're done with that. I can move that out of the way. And I have no more room over here. We could try to put the screws back, but the problem is I, I can't see a dam. And I'm hoping maybe the screws will hold it where it needs to. Uh, I'm going to unplug that just for your safety. Turn it backwards first till it clicks. And then screw it in. Right, right, right. We've heard it all before. And then it's still not going to work. Some tweezers again. What? Come on. I got too much shit out here. I don't know what's going on anymore. It works. It doesn't work. It works. It doesn't work. If I had the damn tweezers, which I had, why can't I see them? Oh, turn it on, Jay. Oh, did we finally knacker it? All that for that, and then we end up with that. How did my tweezers go? I didn't put them over here, right? You gotta watch for me, because sometimes I forget. No, see, they're not there. Well, of course, I got 16 more pair. But I'd like to know where they went. Well, no, not there. Okay. Great. So now it's totally dead. after we just did all that. Wow. How about all that, huh? Did it just finally burn out? Is that possible? Let me look inside again. No, it works again. Still got that weird shit going on.
Yeah, and now it just cut out. got to be something underneath. Blinded by the light. I still can't see because I got all kinds of yellow and blue and green spots. All right, I'm going to take a good look in there. Okay, I am officially blind. I can't see anymore. It's, uh... I'm losing stuff. There it is. It is what it is. It's still knackered. So I think uh, we had actually a compound problem and what the issue is is some sort of shitty connection in a little board in here and it doesn't want to just pull out so um, that's kind of it and it's stuck doing this now kind of works when it wants and then doesn't and does all kinds of wacky shit and then sometimes if I move it a little it'll do shit so it kind of works definitely way overdriven and as far as putting the um, you know like a dot what how about scotch tape right i'm only going in it again when it fucks up i'm leaving it with one screw because it seems to kind of work that way if you just twist it just right so definitely a problem in the base somewhere plus we also had a failed led cruster <laughs> crustal <laughs> So, uh, that's kind of it. We could try just for shits and grins to put the other screw back one more time. This one. Still didn't find those damn tweezers. But it's probably not going to work now. Yeah, same shit. Alright, well, it'll have two screws and then See, and then you just, you bang it, and then sometimes it works, and sometimes it doesn't. So I'm going to just try to find a place where it works, and we'll see how long it lasts. <laughs> That's all I can do. All right, enough playing with this shit. That was fun. I got too much cleaning up here. Um, yeah. Yeah. Like I said, I was either going to fix it or break it trying, and I kind of fixed it and kind of broke it at the same time. But I'm going to leave the cover off. Fuck it, you know. It do what does it really do? It's just blocking most of the light. Fuck it. <laughs> Thanks so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Obviously, you know, there was no saving this thing so I'll put it back in service until it dies again why not <laughs> without the cover not even going to tape it in place to hell with it and uh, it'll die and uh, I'll, I'll get another one sometime probably another LED as much as I actually hate to I might have to end up buying it because I don't think I have any in this like daylight color Maybe there's some shit in the hoard. I'll have to look first. Anyway, that's going to do it. Thanks again. I really appreciate it. Make sure you click like. Make sure you click subscribe. And take care. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.